Hey guys, sorry about that. Sorry, sorry. Hope everyone is doing well. How is it going right now? Right, I hope everyone's hyped for this game now. Let's fade off this music. There we go. Let's see how many times I cry. <laughs> and I also need to get my headset on so you don't get back through the speakers. Right, how it all started. The Walking Dead season two. Play. Right. Uh, save files. Am I doing this right, guys? If anyone's played the definitive series, if I just go play, is it going to start from the from where I left off? Chapter select episode two. Right. Okay. So this is working right. Start episode two. How is the volume as well for you guys? Let me know. You, if my headset's mega loud, you might get feedback. From Previously it, on The Walking Dead. I'm gonna have to move my freezing camera. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Is it me or does this music not match? Have I got something else running in the background? <laughs> so, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn. Oh, yeah, we might have to Damn chop it. off his bloody leg, eh? Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. I'm going to chop it off. If it's a question of if I'm going to chop it off, I'm going to chop it off, lads. Here we go. <laughs> Savage Dark back again. You got it, Liam. You got it. When in doubt, chop it off. Downside, we can't get through them. What are you looking at? You got me leg. Staring ain't polite. What are you going to do? Question is, Clem, what are you going to do? Are you sure? I got nothing to lose, other than my piggly wigglies, of course. <laughs> piggly wigglies. <laughs> Pick and a poke. From the knee, is that necessary? Wouldn't you just chop just above where the bite is? Why take the whole uh, bleed out like a stuck pig? What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just 
Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Is it right? Let's check my backpack. I might have something in here. <coughs> Anything in that? <coughs> Not much. Here. Thanks. Keep looking around. What else do we have? Nothing else. Right, what what are we gonna do? Can I can I quit off myself? You don't want to be trapped in here with Why wouldn't it let me pick that up then? That was annoying. Maybe I can do it from this. Yeah, yeah, okay. No, it won't it won't let me get the hand. That's so annoying. What's in there? Anything we can use? Give me one of those. Uh. Probably tastes like pine tar about now. But I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. I don't like smoke. We're in the middle of a shit sandwich stack this high. A shit sandwich? Like a goddamn government I'm off to eat. Have a nice game and evening. Gross. You to enjoy your food. Get enjoy yours. your food. <laughs> Double time. Got a light? So you're saying you'd be more savage than Dak? Not possible, Terry. Not possible. Hello, Silokin. How are you doing today? <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? Three months clean. <sighs> we wait. We wait. No, we don't. I'm going to chop it off. It's not going to let me chop it off myself. I don't want to wait for you to turn. Wounded guys? Surely I could have just cut it off. Is it going to be too late now? Don't be dead, please. <laughs> Go chopping everyone's limbs off. Says who, Rob? Says who? Chop their leg. Chop their leg. Oh, this ain't Lee no more. <laughs> I feel like 10 pounds of shit in a five pound sack. <coughs> this is not no regular child, though, you Jesus. know? This is Clem. She a beast. Again, the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? Always. I've been thinking, and I don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> it's a knee slapper right there. I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that, but there it is. There it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels like... Like a rope was wrapped around my neck. Mm, getting tighter every second. 
my phone. It feels like I can't. <laughs> can't breathe. So I probably just Would had you? Nick killed for nothing, eh? Because I chose Pete. Would you promise but I thought I was just going to chop it off. I love that stupid kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I watch out for him. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Pete will remember that. Been almost a day. <laughs> Pete's dead. <laughs> he can remember what he wants. Where are you going? If we ever faces on the apocalypse, I would be conflicted to dream of the car with it, I'm chopping off either. Liam, if I need to chop your arm off, Here, lad, I'm gonna be chopping gonna it off. Have to make a break <laughs> for it. I'll buy you some time. Oh, that's nice of him. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? Do what I can for you. I made a promise I'll stick to it. Wait for my signal. And run straight to the woods. Straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. Just keep moving. Just keep moving. I thought we already... Let's get this over with. I thought we already realized that we couldn't get it going. They're just ticking it over to get the attention. Do I have to control this, maybe? I don't want you near me with anything pointy over the edge. <gasps> Was I supposed to be moving that and I was reading the chat? Oh my days. Nando, you just got me killed, lad. <laughs> I was reading your highlighted message. Legit did not realize I had to um, control that then. Here we go. Let's try this again. Just keep moving. Just keep moving. Let's Cheeky get this girl. over with. Oh, Liam, thanks for the vote of confidence there. Right. This time I'm going to control what's going on. Red and gold. Red and gold. Right. I'm making a run. Move, beesh. Get out the way. Thank you, Pete. Love you, Pete. Rip. Ripperonis. <laughs> Pete's like, what the hell? I did that for nothing. <laughs> I know, I just instantly get a bit. Are you all right? Luke's not with you. Yeah, there was no tears what actually happened? on that one. What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus. We all got split up. I was with Pete, but. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. I hate it, like go. the aggression Just from this chick. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Like, I understand that, but, like, yelling at the kid all the time. Looking for you. I told him not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. Just go. Hurry. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. No worries, lad. Not gonna lie, I forgot most of their names. Say cheese! Cheese! And Clem's I like... found this under the house. There was all <laughs> kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. <laughs> Take one of me. 
Come on, take one of me. Sure. sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Get my best side, okay? Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> Q. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? He'll be fine. Are you sure? Keep it vague, Clem. Keep it vague. Sorry. I, I, I just need to... Hey! Luke's back! Which one was Luke? That the nice one. Oh, I don't like the music change. <laughs> Mark. Oh, that's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. What? Why can't he see you? No. Clem, I can't breathe. Oh, she's I having a panic attack. Shh. Uh. Hello. Well, don't open the door because. <gasps> well. Hello there. Shit. Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. Neighbor? That's Cheers, right. Liam. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Hello, I'm sorry to disturb you. I only need a couple Oh, this guy's a creeper. Uh, Clem. Maybe just kill him. Place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. Right, well, they ain't here. While, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. Nope. A couple of farm boys and an old man. No. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. Liar. Bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. Give him a That's bit a of lot sass. Of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. I'm scared. Kick him in the balls, yeah. I'm ready for it. He's rude, I agree, Trem. Oh, Trem, welcome. How are you doing today? He's making me really uncomfortable. I just want him out. Be gone, thought. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed Make to yourself at home, lad. Yes. Through, or been Keeping my eye on that knife. Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not <laughs> sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Just passing through, going north. A whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. Who have you met going north? Oh, hell, a lot of folks. Anyone named Krista? No, not that I can recall. She a friend of yours? Mm-hmm. Oh, I've fucked up. I should have picked up the knife first time round. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. I've, I've I made an error. Four decisions That's have a real begun. Nice place. Kinda cozy. I just don't want to spook him, so he like attacks me. I don't feel like I need to get a weapon without I him even guy, knowing. Just grabbing a knife like in front of him is not going to end well, Doctor. is it? Real smug, son of a bitch. 
but a smart man. What's his name? Carlos. Well, well. White's in trouble. Sarah, please be careful. Three moves away from checkmate. Uh oh. Uh, me dog. Yep, I've got a dog. He's just walking up the stairs. Uh, he can open and close doors as well. Very clever dog. I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> sure, go ahead and look around my house. <laughs> So weird, isn't it? Like, what even? Get out! <laughs> he is a creep, I agree. Do you know whether if there's a weapon around here, Lem? I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Well, you were Couldn't rude. Just leave you here now with a piss good off. Chance if someone was poking around, right? Sure. Oh my god, I'm sweating. He's making me extremely uncomfortable. Well, it's a kid. Yeah, looks like it was taken in this room. Right. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? I don't know how to answer that, so I'm not. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Uh, yeah, I'm not saying anything. I, I don't. I don't really want to say anything. Yeah, I just want him to go. <laughs> He'll remember this. Well, okay. Hopefully, next time I'm going to be more Where prepared. He? He's gone. What if he comes back? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Uh, no, he opened calm it himself. Down. I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask Wait, his name? Wait, did, did we ask he his name? Gun. I didn't want to make him mad. No, we didn't, Clem, did we? Just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? His voice was gravelly. Like how? I don't know, kind of deep and scratchy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Right, no, you didn't. Yeah, I didn't I think know, I did. Which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Yep. He saw a picture of you. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. I took the picture. It's my fault. No, I asked her to. It's my fault. Sarah. We, we want to make friends with Sarah. He was scouting. Alice is a bit overprotective. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. I, I was she very focused on that knife. You're, you're not lying there. Well, he was no too worries, smart Terry. to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. 
We don't have much she time. really does like I sigh I agree everyone pack up we're moving now Alvin wait we have to leave now sweetie before he comes back with more bad guys but it's gonna be okay let's just go get your things what does he want to bring us back Clem I don't know what he told you but William Carver is a dangerous man William Carver. he's the leader of a camp not far from here and he's very smart we were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on the way Wait, out. Wait, did that it just say William Carver? No, was, right? Is that the guy yeah. that was doesn't right. like kids? Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the Thank road. you for the hydrate. Or is this a, a totally different guy? Yeah, just a little ways. Different hey, guy. Okay. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm oh, just a it's about angry. time. She apologized. She's just so a very tough angry. time right now with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us? It's a long story. He... Baby daddy. He has a hard time letting go. I know you did your best back there. <laughs> and posture you check know, as well. Thank you, Captain. On our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. <laughs> Hell's I yeah. Don't you need all him. the patience. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Thank Any you, Ecstasy, for the hydrate. Clem? Oh, yikes. They're gonna see Pete now. Zombie Pete. Yeah, that's where we At were. this rate, guys, I'm gonna have to up my hydrate thing because <laughs> my stomach's gonna explode. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. I know, right? Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. <laughs> you guys. It isn't a al alcoholic beverage. <laughs> but that can be arranged. Might make for a fun stream. <laughs> yeah, toilet break reward. <laughs> Uncle Pete! Pete! Sorry, oh you, you've got to see that, Nick. What happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. So someone he's shot gone. Pete as well. Nick, he, he, he's gone. You gotta get moving. Come on, man. That's rough. <laughs> True that, Ashley. I <laughs> 20 minutes. <laughs> Just be me instantly drunk. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. He saved my life. Well, that was... that was Pete. I'm sorry. about that kid keep an eye on him for me would you you sure you still want to come with us look i know we got off to a rough start and i can't make any promises it won't get rougher but we all know you now we may not be perfect but we look out for each other i don't have anywhere else to go well then welcome to the party yeah welcome to Thanks. the party we're uh we're smarter than we look 
I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. You got it, bud. It's gonna be okay, Ben. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. I really do recognize Callus's voice. I'd love to know who um who was the voice actor for Carlos. Five days, so have we arrived? How's the volume of the, the game and stuff, guys, by the way? Let me know. Oh, yeah, it's just a joke. It's cool. It's cool, Liam. Katik is around most streams. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? It must be that ski resort. Nando's buying I've beer. Nando, you are right, lad. Reckon I went once. It wasn't pretty. Volume's good, thank you. Here, eat this back. But we're almost out of food. We gotta save it. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Surely there's going to be someone in there, though, because, I mean, it is a pretty good location. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. It's funny that they're allowing the kids there's to scope everything house out. By the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Andrew. Hold on now. Chafin, we can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're going to be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm going to sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Is and Luke we'll gonna be the new, like... Minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. Uh, go too. parent-esque character. I'm fine, Luke. Like, I watching like over this. Clem. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens... I'll I do like you. him. Come on. Oh, he voiced Roman, too. Interesting. Clem's a badass, don't worry. Hey. She uh, is, really. Sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. No clue. You're just still on no edge clue. after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not going to get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Can't shoot him. Too much noise. There are only two. I don't know. Let's take them. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. We should got we it. Use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Uh oh. Go ahead. Give us a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed.
Nailed it. Nice Nailed work, it. Kid. Stop. Hammer down. Um. <laughs> Oh, she's such a tease. It's nice that he has trust her and respects her. It seems that way as well, Dean. And I, I, again, I like it. It seems more mutual and mutual respect, you know? Put some respect on this. Yeah, brother esque. I get that for sure. Yeah, she does need a machete. I agree. Well, I ain't going on the wooden bit. I'll tell you that for nothing. Shit. Uh, well, it's getting a bit hairy. I don't like ha a hammer as the as the choice of weapon, because isn't she just gonna? <gasps> oh she! Oh dear. Why can't I move it? Why can't I move it? This game, it kills me. I mean, literally kills me. But I, I couldn't do anything then. Death counter, guys. Death counter, my bad. I've got to look around better. Right, so I know I can't grab him. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll figure something out. Behind you. Oh, shit. Yeah, ah, so I just swing it. Usually it comes up with like a place that I can put like that. That had a that had something that I could flip. This is so intense, like I hate it. I actually hate it. Oh, brilliant. Yep, no weapon now as well. Love that. Oh my god! <sighs> oh, please. She's a beast, it's fine. She's a beast. And move, move, move. Right, we need a weapon. Yes, get the machete. Swing. Swing it. Um, this is this is an absolute nightmare. This is not going well. Yep, get down, beesh. Pipe will do as well. Keep me distance, and I can pull. Uh, yes, I can pull Luke up with it, maybe. Here, give it here. Fun. We, we did it, I think. Did we just do it? <laughs> just bite the walkers. <laughs> I think it would throw them off, in fairness. Thanks, Clem. Hey, Findrius, thank you so much for that streak there as well. Thank you so much. Let's keep going. Can't believe I'm late for The Walking Dead. I know, how dare you? But thank you so much for joining. That was intense, that guy is intense. Yeah. Just play it cool. I'm you cool. Do the what? Uh, just, your what name's mean? Ed, okay? I don't want to get in a fight. <laughs> you really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sense. the woods, they moves. fall down. I should have probably and done that. Don't piss him off. Is he with Carver? It's hard to see. I don't think so. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. Oh, my bad, Pinterest. Wanna help me out here? I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Okay. 
Okay, very tense. A very large gun. Huh. Not you excited like by assholes. it. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. You're the one holding a gun. Touche. You folks headed north like everyone else? Yes, ready for the weekend, Vindrius. I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say, you two look like shit. <laughs> if you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station. Bit there. rude, lad. Well, Bit rude. that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got uh, food supplies back in the station. I'm not sure how I feel about this. If so many people pass through, why would he be so oh, fuck, open man. to let people in? He would have been screwed what over. What the hell is he doing? Nick. Nick. No, 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 no. He's he's with us. Nick. No. Don't shoot. <laughs> This guy, man, we've got another Ben on our hands. We, you know how I'm gonna handle that, guys. <laughs> Did I hit him? Where is he? I told Could you be not a trap to shoot him. Who was that guy? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick! I, told I mean, you technically, not to we don't know that, do we? To hear you. you gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Gonna keep me peepers on Nick. Because um there's a bit much that. <laughs> Nick the dick. <laughs> Who the fuck was that back then? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. <laughs> what did you see, Claire? Shut up, Think Meg. I Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? Because you're an asshole? Oh, I think I took too long then. Either way, you could have hit one of us. <laughs> yeah, so I true, Liam. So true. Look, I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station mind checking it out maybe we could spend the night here a little small for us though you could use a little downsizing he may have been lying about the food we can't trust anyone it's worth checking out it is worth it who knows who's gonna be here as well are you gonna end the stream or on the walking dead or play Valor on stream as well. I'm not sure yet, Nando. We'll see how it goes. I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Ah, uh, so he's messed up because of that. Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on. Imagine opening up to an 11 year old. Some fucking plan. Saying all your deep and dark secrets. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. <laughs> yes, Ashley. Literally. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I uh, wish I could just keep moving. I wish you were like time. him as well. <laughs> I'm just not. Any consolation? Like Wish we were like that. I'm 
sure they're talking about me right now. Yeah, five Do days walk in while pregnant. Ouch. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. Yeah, I think you are. A little bit. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? <laughs> Major Kangles. Damn. Damn. <laughs> Legit, though. Well, I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. Oh, I've got a watch. I found it back at the cabin. Let me grab it. What? Really? Thank you. <sighs> this means... Thank you, Clem. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Let's have a mooch about here now. See if the guy was telling the truth or if Nick didn't make a mistake by shooting him in the neck. Ooh. The man said he had lots of food. There's gotta be something left. A lot of empty cans, I see. Locked. <sighs> and he's, of course, he's probably gonna have the key keys on here. him. That man probably had it. Yep. The sly thief with a heart, that's me. W M. Feels pretty good. That time you had a decent weapon as well. Alright. Can I use the knife to pick the lock, maybe? There's nothing else around here, so I'm going to do that. <laughs> A knife for her, I know it. I'd be the kill anyone who I don't trust. Oh, out of sight, zombie apocalypse. I bet a bit off here. Two cans! Oh, nice of you to join. Man, not thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Bit rude. Yes, he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. Give him a break. His uncle just died. Yeah, true enough. <laughs> I don't know what I did. Yeah, for this, true. I'm just saying. I mean, you ever know anyone to do a thing like that? Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. <laughs> That's funny. She looks just like you. Uh, hey, Claire. Don't see it myself, not but a lot of food here, <laughs> sure. Like Rebecca. Well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but. And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. The whole group should decide. I know you're right. It's just so hard right now. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. Is he just trying to bottom me up so I let him take the peaches? The hell is that? Oh great, a horde. Walkers. Horde of walkers. We got a problem here. My fave thing to yeah, see. We saw it. Alright, we're heading up. And off they pop. Hello, Ego. Welcome, welcome. How's your day been so far? Well, what are we waiting for? Too we soon, Liam, too soon. Careful. We all know that worked out for, for Rick. Days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Hello? Anybody hey, there? Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. 
Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back Long there. and slow, bad times. You'd probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? Sure. That'd be just like climbing a treehouse. I, I had, had a treehouse tree once. once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. <laughs> Just take it slow, and I'll I catch you this, if you fall. I got this. I got this. Probably. Probably. <laughs> Great. Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. How long is this episode? If anyone remembers. <gasps> whoa, whoa, uh, Clem, fine. don't turn into fine. Lee. Just look at me, okay? You're you're fine. All right, just just slow down. Just for a second, okay? I know I'm fine. Just trying to help. I got it. I got it. They should have broke some of the wood to get walks fall and people could just go to the metal at least. True, true, true. Oh, hello, friend. Made it. Oh, bye, friend. <laughs> See anything? Just me in real life with friends. I can see the bridge. Um, I see the bridge. What else do I see? It's really dark. It is wait, a bit dark. I see something. Oh, what is it? A light. light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. You ran off a bit too soon then, you not think? Yeah, not the brightest thing, eh? Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, She's a you savage, yeah. Uh. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, Fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just Damn do gross. what he says. Oh my god, I just got the biggest chills. Kenny. Wait, you know this guy? He was I'm fine. Fine. I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. Oh my days. It's, it's so good to see him. With his full on beard and everything. Kenny. I love you, my dude. Cute! Jenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. Nice. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night too. It's okay. I didn't cry, Finjus. I did not but cry. We found this stuff in storage. We couldn't resist making an exception. So That's good, funny. Nando. Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans too. Mean well, can why of don't beans. You two catch up while I get some dinner started. Please make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. <laughs> the hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. Oh, Nick, don't We're even start. Here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Do you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm... Us. Good. You were the one waving a gun around, man. I can't speak for everyone. Beck, it's their home. 
We're not going to find another. She was honest like though, tonight. like she can't speak for everyone, yeah. Dad, look, a Christmas tree. Not now, Sarah. She's not going to have a look at the Christmas tree. Found it all in storage. It's amazing. The music as well. <laughs> Same, Ashley. I'm glad. I'm glad that he's all good. Just do it, Nick. There we go. There we go. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Lord Carrie, you have a package to collect. It can be open right away if you wait. Oh, okay. Thank you so much, Ego. I can't believe you sent me something else as well. I did get an email about that today, actually. Uh, was it today? Maybe not. My days are all merging. I am so down for this little scene already. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Lee and I had our differences, that's for sure. But when my son, well, he was there for me. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while. But these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. No. Nope. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand and then it got messier. For a minute there, it wasn't looking I'd too good Kenny. for old Kenny. Every time, Katika. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita. Thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. He moved on quick, hey, Where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? <laughs> Liam. <clears throat> it's been over 18 Clementine? months, Jack. Settling I mean, true, you know but... Yeah, thanks. It Excellent. hurts my heart. Okay, Marcus, Wanna help it me hurts. prepare a little dinner? Gotcha. Rip. So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. I manage just fine. Now you really do sound like one of my students. And you sound like a teacher. I'll take that as a compliment, <laughs> thank you. Clem's not vibing with this guy. <laughs> mm. Almost done. True, Rob. Would you do true. me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Looks great. It looks like mush. <laughs> looks. No, right. it doesn't. 
Mm -mm -mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. Huh. Striking resemblance. I don't get this. Just because anyway, she's got pigtails. No towel or anything. Oven mitts. Just fix it straight up off the hob. Interesting. Reminds me of school. I haven't What's seen song one you're of these since Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? Well, it's about a king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm. Glenn, we could use some completely help. interrupt us, Sora. You take this and string them up over there. I'm gonna stop you there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. So, how'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up. You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. I mean, this is beautiful here. Kind of want to just stay chill in here forever. Kenny, is that all right with you, my dude? Can she not just sit down and have a nap? She has been through a lot. What a funny little guy. <laughs> oh, what a funny little guy. Lone Pie, a winter park trail map. Can we take this? Apparently not. Hello, Hannah Hannah. Thank you for entering the chat. Actually, let's see if we can go upstairs. Hello, Beesh. Hello, hello. I imagine this is the calm before the storm. I mean, you're probably not wrong. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. Never out of they the might woods. Be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? A Christmas dog. <laughs> Cleanse. Luke said you saw some people in the valley. <laughs> people? Way down there. Ego! My dude, thank you so much hey. for those gifted subs. See, thank you, thank you. Yes, Trem got one as well. Moff Dean and Rowan. Enjoy. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But yes, enjoy the supernatural tonight, upload right? later. Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? <laughs> the loud yeah, man. That's him. <laughs> Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Thank you for enjoying those Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Uh oh. I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. She looks so cool. Cute. <clears throat> Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. You're so early Matthew on in Walter this game. Amazing people. WTF. Honestly, I am indeed. Season 2, kind, episode 2. But they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. 
The first time he met me, he called me Rita. So I call him Maddie now. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. Long walks? He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days, like everyone else. I haven't noticed. I know, we, oh. we've only been here for like a hot well, minute. Let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Strange thing to Kenny. say that. Isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Oh, snappy. He always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? It's very tense, isn't it? Definitely more to it. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. Considering doing some other Telltale games after myself. Walker, I'd like the Wolf Among Us. Sure. If anything's like this, I mean, I'm down. How can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. I think it's possible. How do you know? Well, I'm still here. I know it's going to be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. You! I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You want to listen? That food smells good, huh? It's okay. No thanks. No thanks. <laughs> That's okay. I don't know if That's I trust weird, Kenny's right? lady. I don't know if I trust the whole situation, to be fair. There's something odd about it. It's not his. <laughs> Lolita, I feel that. Whose is it, then? If Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. I... I wouldn't say anything. There's my man. You all right, baby? Awkward. Right, Imagine if she just started talking just then. Just some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Girl, you're not ready for the Try end of see. this game. Like, it's a lot and you will cry. Great. Love that. I've already cried, I think, three or four times at this so far. And we're only on season two, episode two, so. Yay. A zombie baby. You okay, man? <laughs> Talking season yeah, five ending just... or season two. I wish I hadn't The ending of the whole thing. Just try to forget about it. Yikes. Right here, Clem. Oh, no. They're not doing this. I've got to choose which... <laughs> Which seat to sit at? Are you kidding me right now? Right, guys. I don't know what to choose here because this is my thought process. If I sit with Luke, it's thanking him for the time, like the short time, like getting across the bridge. He's been helping her a lot. Like they, they definitely have that brother relationship or I can, brother sister relationship, or I can sit with Kenny knowing that I haven't seen him for a long time and just letting him know that, like, I trust him. What do I do? Just like school, who are you going to choose? The OG guys are the cool kids. So you think the left table is the cool kids? See, I'd, I'd say Kenny was the cool kid. Kenny was my dude, so I'm biased. You do what you want. Surely they... Get it that you haven't seen Kenny in ages. You'd think so, Mofty, and you'd think so. At least we've got him um, 18-ish weeks to prep her. Kenny all the way. Yeah, my gut is saying Kenny just because I love him. But, like, I'm trying to be logical about it. Do I let them think, like, I've got more trust with them? I'm going to go with Kenny. Here you go, Clem. Oh, that hurts my heart because so I do Clem, love Luke we as talking. well. 
What's the deal with the kid? What's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? Oh, I'm gonna do a poll. So Sorry, my bad. Know these folks. They seem nice. Yeah. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? Yeah, I I mean I did. I think so. On the bridge. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry about that no more. Big Al. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Absolutely. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. If that's what she wants. Thank you. Of course. This is like a dream. Damn it, I am so happy right now. I, I can't even tell you. He's creeping me out, him, the teacher guy. It makes me feel uncomfy. But I want Luke with us as well. Nick, I could do without. <laughs> you can't sit with us, Nick. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Thank you for the hydrate. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> so, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard uh, of a place going called up north. Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. What kind of place? Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Kenny's at it again. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold ass winters, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, vanilla ice. I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. It's, he's not poisoned the bloody dish, has he? Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> duck? Who's Duck? Duck was his son. Hey, Clementine. Uh oh, you, uh, guys. Lend me a hand outside for a moment. You saw him taste test it. True, but not from him pointing it in the bowls, you know. I'm sus of everyone, Finn. I'm sus of everyone. I honestly think this game is better played if you go with your heart over your head. Noted, noted. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher. And I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? Everything will not be fine. <sighs> do you really think everyone can just get along? Do we trust this guy, guys? Do we trust him? I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use okay. our heads. Kind of like that. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. Maybe I was too judgy of him too In soon, case, you know. The point is, as long as we have our wits about us, he just gave me creepy vibes. Right? Right. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. 
There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. It's nothing. Forget I don't trust him yet, guys. I'm sorry. I just don't trust him yet. Oh, politics? The hell? Not being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Oh, it's, um, Bonnie. Wait, what's her name, Bonnie? Or Molly? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in? Bonnie, Miss... Bonnie. Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. But what about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. Okay. She chose not to come with the group, though. I have a little girl like you. Hey. Okay. How old are you, sweetie? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. I'm pretty mature. My age. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't miss He's just me. giving her all of that. I know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank wow, so okay. Much. I'll be going. Generous. You stay safe. You too. Except me too, Lilia. That's what I mean. He's not really done anything Clean, yet. Go and get but he ju bed. I'm just getting Walt uncomfy I vibes from him. Maybe the looks, the glances. I don't know. What do you do you think about seeing Kenny again? Oh, I was all for it, J2. All for it. Gave me chills when I saw him. Don't freak out. It's fine. I don't from DLC. <laughs> Some supplies of the entire house. It was a lot that. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Oh. See, yeah, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out? Would they have to know, though? My gut saying I won't say anything. I won't say anything. Okay, okay, good. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. Oh, smart. Weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. And I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. Nothing. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. It's it's nothing, really. Forget it. Look, Clem, just I don't trust Nick do yet, that. sorry guys, so I am right. gonna lie to him. Come on, Nick, let's go find a beer or something. He's too much of a hothead right now to be showing stuff like that. He's gonna just end up making a mistake. <laughs> I agree, Xizzy, that was a bit much. There was definitely a look of almost it's gone. crying. <laughs> Cheers, Vindress. <laughs> Throw me under the bus. Oh, I know, Lolita, I know. Was I supposed to move then and I was reading chat again? He's already found the knife. Are you okay? I always like this knife. Um, Gave it to Matthew when all this started. Okay, don't like this. I know he's dead. Who did it? A 
Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I can see it. Just crab walk away, Clem. Space. Crab walk the hell trying. away. But now. Oh guys, I'm freaking out. I don't know what to I don't know which one to push. I don't owe this guy anything. And he was giving me creepy vibes, but he hasn't physically done anything to me. But that was a very quick turn. Like it, it's like it's not even him anymore. Which makes me think more so that it was a front before and he was just faking it. Remember what Lee taught Clem? What was it, Ashley? What was it? He is he is scaring me. I know, same. Don't give up Nick yet. Oh my gosh. Honesty always prevails. You guys are making it even harder to decide because I, honestly, I want to say... <sighs> I want to say, I want to say that it wasn't Nick. Po yeah, go for a poll, guys. Go for a poll. I'm stressing. I honestly don't remember. I was just trying to be supportive. <laughs> Ashla. Right. I'll wait and see what you guys think. Personally, I was going to say not to throw Nick under the bus but more so for Luke not for Nick and I don't really trust this guy he's probably lovely and I'm just being sus but the vibes weren't there heart head my heart is saying my heart is saying to stick with Luke is that a poor decision I don't know guy gives me Fred West vibe hells yeah same there's just there's something not right there I'm just always straight with people no sugar coating I mean it's a very good trait to have Rob I hate Nick same Nick isn't my favorite but I do love Luke and throwing Nick under the bus is gonna affect Luke which I don't want to do you promised Pete. I did promise Pete. Oh my God, seriously, you're fanatic. You just nailed it there. I'd stick with Kenny. Yeah, but I did, I did promise Pete to protect Nick. I don't trust the teacher. He gave away way too much. It, that was weird as well. That was really weird that he would just do that and then instantly change it. Should Dakara lie? No, you all don't want me to lie. You all want me to throw Nick under the bus, even though I made Pete a promise. Interesting. Kara, you didn't give a rip about Pete. <laughs> I love me some Pete. I just wasn't overly connected yet, you know? I didn't have that long to, to get to know him. But I did promise him. <sighs> I'm going to go with a poll, obviously, and it's a pretty much... A clear choice looking at the poll that you want me to be honest. You were prepared to saw his leg off, but yeah, to save him, Moff Dean. To save him, not to kill him. It's weird that someone is nice. It actually is though, Dennis. It's, it's odd. <laughs> you wanted to dismember him too, to save his life. Right, okay. I'm going to tell him that it was Nick then, eh? Right, here we go. It was us. It was our fault. You told Walter the truth. I think that's a good decision. I've got my doubts, Ashley. Jesus. I, um... <laughs> I don't feel good. Rod. Nick shot him. He's gripping the knife. Is, uh, Is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? Don't say anything. Just one of those, uh, 
don't say Fuckers anything. Don't give a shit about anyone but themselves. We don't know Nick well enough yet to be like, he's a good guy, you know? To save it was to save him, bro. But I liked he was he. Going out alone. Liked, I told not loved, the like. He wouldn't listen. I'm sick with like. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to get out of here. This world is hell. People like Matthew aren't coming back. This is it, and now he's gone. What did you do? Did you hurt him? Did you hurt Matthew? Kind of shot him in the neck. He's being so weird. Oh. Okay, not what I thought do was going to happen. All right. Oh, Nick lied. Nick lied. Well, what's going on? We're just going to end up with loads of power because the wind turbines are going insane right now. The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's going to draw walkers. We got to shut it down now. Oh, but the energy. The guns? Guns? I am no the governor, okay. It's a damn dinner bell. Well, that didn't sound good. Damn it. The transformer must have gone. Got to check it. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No. It's too dangerous. The rest of you get this thing shut down. Okay. Does anyone know how to do this? Great. I can do it. Okay. We'll watch your back. There Nick, is no jar. The okay, guys. I do not have a jar filled with limbs. Nick didn't lie, he doesn't know him. <gasps> true, very true. Sorry, my bad. Totally my bad. Burn it with the lighter? That doesn't sound... Oh my god, this doesn't sound smart. Do I have to do this? Oh, I'm just using it as a lighter. <laughs> I was thinking we were going to burn it. Oh my days. She's so smart. Prove it. <laughs> I don't have one. And of course, an 11 year old is smarter than two adults. Something ain't right. Three adults if you're including me because I legit thought she was just gonna take a flame to it. <laughs> like this doesn't sound smart, Clem. <laughs> we don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us. Oh, here we go. Well, the gunfire is going to draw in a load more as well. Oh. Did I not? I thought I pushed down quick enough then. Panics a bit. Well, this ain't good. Oh, I kind of just want to run though. Oh, I missed that. Stop moving. Oh. Wait, I did not shoot her in the arm. Oh, for, f for crying out loud. Run. Literally just run. Run away. Why is she stood there? Thank you, Carlos. Thank you. Run, 
Oh, but the gun is left the big gun. Grab it, grab it. Please. Oh, add a bit of a kick to it, that one. Yes. Uh, take the knife. Oh, Jesus. Nailed that. Maybe pick up the gun as well. <gasps> oh my days. Do we help? Do we help? Do we help? Oh, 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 oh. Is he going to help Nick or is he going to kill him? He killed him. He actually killed him. He made that decision. He made that decision. Did indeed see what you did. Clementine, are you okay? What the hell? Who the hell's this? <laughs> that killed Nick. I did no such thing. Oh no. <gasps> Bonnie was with him. Howdy, folks. Where's Rebecca? Carver. It's nice to see you too. Really? Oh! Dad! Sarah! Thank you, back up for the follow and J2O as well. Thank you so much, guys. Inside. Okay, so confirmed. Bonnie's a bitch. Don't trust Bonnie, lads. Give her a load of food and then she just comes back for more. Greedy bean. Look at this place. Hmm. Right, Big Al. What's the plan, lad? Okay. You believe this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Hmm. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them, too? Oh, this is risky. Johnny, cover that window. Trust no one? Hells yeah. Can't believe you killed Nick. I didn't kill Nick! Please, guys. Is Clem going to clutch this up now? Save the day. Is she going to get an ace? Just ping, ping, ping. <laughs> I hate this guy. It creeps me out. There's so many creepers in this game. The teacher is with them. I kind of felt that. I felt that gut punch. Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, Rebecca? look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Holy crap! Our deserves to be raised in a place of safety. 
True, Ashley. Thank you for the support. Melvin, Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all Tax more nice. deadly than the walkers. <laughs> He'll kill him. Oh, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. We start shooting and people are gonna die on both sides. Yes! Clint can sneak out. Find Lou. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. I've got a feeling Big shoot Al's him. gonna die, you Somebody know. Just shoot him. Clint, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't I'll find Luke and Kenny. Stay here. God damn it. Alvin's doing it anyway. Oh, Alvin's gonna do it anyway. Oh no, he's coming with me. Let him off. I'll let you off, big Al. He's gonna cut off his ear. I don't even know where to start. Where do, I, can, I can't even remember what they said. Where were they going? Clamp. Oh, he's there, he's there, he's there. SOS, Kenny. SOS. <gasps> Hello, the doctor. Welcome to the stream. A very intense moment right now. He's took his ear, Annie. You all right? What are we gonna do? I don't know. He's not gonna take a shot. We need to... <gasps> they've they've just gone down the stairs. They've just gone down the stairs. Anyway, he literally did it anyway. We're gonna have some casualties here. Oh my god, yeah, there he goes, there he goes. Walt! Oh my god. <laughs> That's for our man. Now, I didn't want to do this, but you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. Motherfucker. Well, I think he made his choice there. Oh, no. Alvin's next. Tell him to stop. Can he stop? <gasps> Alvin. Damn. It's a tough shot. What do you think? Clamp. Don't shoot. What? He'll kill him. We can't just give up. Kenny, he'll keep doing this. Think about Sarita. Yeah. We're coming out. Let's go. She's not gonna. Oh my god. 
Where's Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Well, not it's not looking good for us, lads. I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. <laughs> All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. Well, I'm not feeling confident about my very poor decisions, guys. Oh, that was it as well. Oh my God. Son of a bitch would have shot Walt no matter what we did. Well, I ain't going out like that. Not without a fight. Okay. I know. Folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. Oh, no. I hate that this is the way it's going, going right now. I don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them. Knowing full well... Those who choose not to accept our love. Well, we don't want Kenny in trouble there now. Oh, my days. Okay. So, let's clarify. Friendship took blame for Sarah's photo. You and 48.5% of players took the blame. So, yeah, minority. What a shocker. Loyalty, who did you sit with at dinner? You and 64, right? So I made the right choice with Kenny then. Or should I say you guys have made the right choice with Kenny? <laughs> told Walter the truth about Matthew. You and 56% of players told Walter the truth. Uh, Nick's fate, you and 43.7% of players let Walter make up his own mind. So I should have... I should have told Walter what to do left to find Kenny you and 43.9 percent of players sought Kenny's help left to find so I have made some very very poor decisions in today's The Walking Dead I think we can clarify that um I don't, I'm a little I'm a little confused. Let's just say that. Let me swap the screen over. I am a little confused because I feel as though whenever I'm playing this game, I just panic and then I'm like overthinking everything. And like Findria said, it's heart over head on the most of like these decisions. And I always keep trying to like go for that for, for my gut choice. But then my head's like overpowering it and then I end up changing it because I'm overthinking it. So I'll think, right, well, my, my gut is saying sit with Kenny and then my mind's going, yeah, but if you do that, Luke will then think X, Y, and Z. Uh, Nick will think blah, blah, blah. And you know what I mean? And I'm just overthinking it all. You did great. All the right decisions were made. Ashley, you lie, but I appreciate it. Let's kill that guy first thing next <laughs> Next thing, next episode. Excuse my typos. It's all J. First thing, next episode. That's the point of the game. I know, I know. I need to just act quicker, I think, rather than like freezing and then being like, but what about this and what about that? And just go for my gut. And as well, I need to make sure that I'm paying attention to the game a lot more because I feel if I wasn't streaming this, my decisions would be totally different. And I need to make sure that next Friday, I'm 100% invested in the story and where it's going. Um, I still I still kind of stand by my decision to not let uh, Kenny shoot the gun when the guy was moving Alvin. And a lot of that has to do with him saying, it's a really difficult shot. <laughs> because I didn't want Kenny to accidentally kill Alvin. And then, yeah, that would just, it'd have been rough then, you know what I mean? And I think sometimes I'm uh, wanting Clem to remain pure instead of just letting Clem survive. 
I think it's like when I was watching The Walking Dead and uh, obviously Carl was very young. Carl Grimes was very young at the start. And you've got two options. You can do what Carlos is doing to Sarah and like bubble them uh, or, you know, like Lee did with Clem, teach him how to use weapons, teach him this, teach him that, like Judith has done as well. And I think I need to just let her be, let her be a badass. Don't be holding her back. What was your issue with Nick? With Nick, it, it's his like his hot head, like decision making that I didn't like. He was he was very aggressive straight away. He didn't want to help Clem when she come up with the the, the cut on her arm. So flag there. Nick equals Ben too, but no. See that was my thought when I saw Nick. I was like, we've got another Ben on our hands here. Uh, but yeah, rip, rip her own is for Nick as well. Um, and plus, uh, with me wanting to stand by my decision with Pete and say, yeah, I'll look after him, it made it very conflicting. Yeah. I think I will end the stream here, maybe. And I shall see you all again, hopefully, tomorrow. Maybe. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.